live. What to do, guys? We're here with the Dexmas today. We're doing Dragon Ball back to our roots. And uh, it's Ryan Reeve here today. Uh, did a lot of battling since like three, three in the afternoon. It's like almost one. And anyways, today we're doing Vegito. Uh, my original leader, um, not this specific one, but Vegito is my first leader ever in Dragon Ball. And I love him. I still have all my cards from him. Uh, super excited that we have extra cards coming out in Anniversary Edition. Definitely be making a deck profile on that and an official deck, pro deck on it. And maybe if we ever go back to regular events, uh, I will bring it to an event. But let's start. We have here uh, Vegito, the new leader from the structure deck. Oh, starter deck, I'm sorry. Starter deck, and then Vegito, uh, Godhood Transcended. He's good. What kind of sucks about him is that he requires the unison, sort of, uh, because activate main, oh sorry, activate battle requires the, un the unison, and then the rest of his effect, his skill, rec sort of requires unison. They also use battle cards, but um, it's good. I prefer other cards, but there's specific cards in here that require Vegito leader, and so it sucks. But I was using the uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku that got rebooted and also the Soul Striker that got rebooted. But like I said, you'll see exactly what I'm talking about in a little bit. So let's start with the deck. We're using the Gogeta Unison. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous art. I like this specifically because uh, if you have a rested battle card, you, um, well, say in blue, whatever, uh, he, you can get your leader damage, which is really good. You can do just cheesy plays, just sit on this sit on uh, one of the other Goji Vegito cards I'll show you. It's not bad. Definitely better than the other Unisons out right now until we get more support. We have two uh, Mais. I might bump to four just so I can get the search off. We have two Gokus from the starter deck, if I'm not mistaken. I'm gonna stick with two only because I have Vegitos that pull from the deck, so it's not that required. The search uh, taken from life it's pretty good too. Get you awakened a little quicker if you have to, if your opponent is not helping you through the leader effect or skill. We have Super Saiyan Trunks. I love this Trunks. He, you play him, well, you combo with one blue, and then you can play a two drop uh, from your hand or less. And the skill's negated, but it goes in rest mode, which doesn't matter because it helps your Vegito plays. Then we have uh, three Saiyan Duo Son Gokus, the one that plays out the Vegeta from deck or drop, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, this Vegeta. It goes together. Three. I use three and three. Some people don't use any. I just like having a nice amount of attackers, a nice amount of skill cards. Low cost, preferably, because the Vegetos are what power the deck. We've got two Vegetos from the starter deck. We got for the Vegitos, we have the three uh, World Strongest Candy. It's good. I mean, I personally don't like too much of Vegitos that, that are blue, like the candy ones. I really like the red ones, which are my favorite. But right now, they're not viable in any sort. Uh, especially with needing a, a red stuff to evolve. Red Goku's, red Vegitos. We have another Goku, uh, sorry, uh, the Gohan for the Super Combo. Goes with the Zamas. We have the Vegito powers combined. I think it's the only Vegito that it requires evolving in his deck. So maybe bring it to four. He just doesn't do anything. You can attack with him, get one damage off, force maybe a combo, and then use the activate main to uh, start playing with the energy Vegitos. But he's all right. I just put this Trunks in. You guys, the OGs, remember this Trunks, the OGs in the first, first or second expansion set. Uh, he's cool. He searches any Vegito, basically, because the the level requirement, the cost requirement doesn't matter in his deck. But basically, searches any Vegito you need. Uh, he's alright. He has crit. Yeah, he's fine. You have the awe-inspiring Vegito, because it plays beautifully with the Unison that's on top. We have the one Vegito full throttle. He's cool. He gets wins. But, I mean, he's alright. I might bring him back to two, but uh, he's... Eh, sort of. You have Vegito. This one is only for playing from the deck to get your other Vegito off, your powers combined, because powers combined is important because it plays your Vegitos from the energy area. So that's why it's important. You can't play this, obviously, because he's red and you have no red cards in his deck, but you, you just use him to ditch. He's, a, he's any cost, you just send him and do all the plays. He's the problem in this deck because he requires a Vegito leader. That's why I was mentioning the whole problem of Vegito. 
But I mean, if you're not gonna play him, you might as well not play the Kennedy cards because it's really hard to play any Vegito cards from Energy without being lucky enough to get the Vegito powers combined, basically in a nutshell. And for the Secret Rare, because every deck usually likes the Secret Rare in there, uh, you or Ultimate, you have the Black Smoke Dragon. He's really busted. I thought he was bad, but warping seven cards from the top of your opponent's deck and right get king to warp everything from the field and your opponent's side or warping four cards from the hand is just really brutal if you get to play this off and have maybe some attacking cards or a vegeto or maybe an uh, all inspiring you're going to win the game he just does a lot of stuff a lot of stuff i'm gonna move this sideways so we can uh continue yeah a nice fan Put these to the side because we don't need them right now. So we have extra cards. We have one Kamehameha um, Ultra Instinct. It's cool. I've never pulled it. I've had, I ran three before and then two and then I turned it to one once Reeve came over and I never saw it. I, I don't even I think I played it. You have the four Dimension Magic because he's important. Also, you tap out usually really quickly. So being able to take from life to just activate the dimension magic, stand your energies again, helps a lot. Sense of Beans are four. I don't like Sense of Beans, but um, they do what they do. They're good and energy manipulation is good in this deck. And your one, your wide open. I just wanted a counterplay. Uh, it's okay. I just wanted a counterplay. The problem is it only it requires a four drop or less that your opponent plays. So it's like, meh. But yeah. This is uh, my Vegito deck, uh, mostly mono blue. We're not counting the red Vegito. We're not count counting this one because you don't play it. But um, if you guys like it, leave a comment, subscribe, uh, like it, dislike it. Just let us know what you think about it. And we do have a uh, Discord in the description down below. Join us. Uh, we do provide more content there. Uh, no, we're not charging anybody. It's free. Uh, more deck profiles, more content, exclusive stuff questions uh live battles would still trying streaming and yeah so uh, until next time probably my next build i try to revive this a little bit clean up a little bit or just start building for the red that comes out i think next month we already pre-ordered boxes so yeah this is a uh, ryan and uh reeve from the Dexmas here with vegeto until next time see you guys